Good evening. A town hall in Cambridge filled with frustration. Residents voicing their concerns to council about crime surrounding a homeless encampment on Main Street. Well, now the mayor is sharing her thoughts on the main takeaways from that meeting. CDP Stephanie Davis has been following the story for us today. Joins us live this hour now. Now, Steph, what were residents at the meeting last night saying? Well, Alex, last night's town hall was focused on safety. There were points raised about things like traffic safety and affordable housing, but the majority of people shared their experience about what it's been like living near the encampment at 150 Main Street. People living near 150 Main Street in Cambridge have seen a lot recently. I witnessed firsthand the countless overdoses in the parking lot. To not be able to ride my bicycle downtown without being fear of it getting stolen, it's, it affects the community. I've had my front door kicked in. A homeless encampment has been standing in the lot since August. At a town hall Thursday, people with homes nearby say it's caused unwanted disturbances in the area. Well, dealing with childhood cancer for my son, I've had to deal with a spike in violent crime activity in my own front yard. Waterloo Regional Police say they responded to 160 calls at the site between January and June. For some neighbors, homelessness is familiar. I understand homelessness. I do. Don't get me wrong. I was in the shelter for four months with three children. But they say the encampment has been in place too long with no solution. This man says he lived at the encampment for eight months. It's unfair that residents have to deal with the riffraff that goes on. I just want to say that the people living there are not generally all always the problem. He moved to the Herbs Road hybrid shelter and says he's been on track ever since. These mentally ill people have staff and support, they have food, they have hygiene services. They're not sitting around doing nothing all day. They're not out stealing. He says a similar model could help. A sanctioned encampment here in Cambridge would work wonders. Cambridge Council heard the concerns. The mayor saying her own family has experienced crime in the area, but she says it's Waterloo Region's jurisdiction. Most of the problems that were brought to the table and the questions that were brought to the table were items that we have no control over. She says she and other regional councillors who were at the town hall can bring the concerns to the region. But those stories help us get to the end and highlight what she calls a need for regional restructuring. This was just a very small indicator of why that sort of thing is necessary. It's not just planning issues, it's safety concerns as well. No one from the region was available for an interview and did not provide a comment. The mayor says another town hall with representatives from the region and police will be held September 18th. Stephanie Davis, CTV News, Cambridge. Now, residents, as we just heard, will have another chance to ask council about community safety concerns on September 18th. At that meeting, the mayor says representatives from Waterloo Region and police will also be there to answer any questions residents may have. Alex. All right, Stephanie Davis reporting live for us tonight. Thank you for that, Steph.